right, you poor novices, it is time to get those feet moving. Let's see how you handle this one. Drex here from Drex Factor Poi, bringing you the love of poi spinning and flow arts to benefit your body and brain. And today, I am giving you a beginner combo that really takes only two tricks. But the really great part of it is that it uses a lot of footwork, which I'm a big fan of. Before we dive in, I just want to give a quick shout out to the friends of the channel. Big thanks to Dark Monk, Flow DNA, Flow Fests, Flow Toys, Juggling Calling, Pyroterra Light Toys, Spinballs, and Ultra Poi for helping to make the videos on this channel possible. You can learn more about all these amazing companies and the work that they're doing to support flow artists like yourself by checking out the links that I've got down in the description of this video. So I really wanted to put a Relio Trulio beginner level combo out this month and uh, I was kind of racking my brains on ways that I could beat my previous best of I think only like two or three tricks and what I came up with was uh, something that I really enjoyed mainly because it used so much footwork. Uh, this one really, if you really really want to stretch, it only uses two tricks but I would really say that if you can do butterflies that's all you really need. And hey, what the heck, I'll go ahead and link to a tutorial for butterflies down in the description and, you know, just for good measure, I'll go ahead and include a link for stalls as well because they'll probably also be helpful, but definitely not necessary for getting this one down. Uh, yeah, you can find a link down in the description to those tutorials as well as up in the cards if you happen to be watching this video on YouTube. I will show you the combo at full speed, then break it down for you step by step before finally showing it to you again in slow motion. Alright, so real talk, this combo literally just comes down to being able to do a forwards butterfly and then switching to a reverse butterfly. Everything else is just fancy footwork and me running back and forth across the stage, but uh, I still like it anyway, so we're gonna dive in. So let's first just deal with what the poi are doing with minimal footwork, uh, and then we'll go ahead and add all the fancy footwork back in and everything. So let's just talk about what the poi are doing for a second. Basically, if you can do this thing where you do a forwards butterfly, go out to the sides, reverse butterfly, go across, forwards butterfly, out to the sides, reverse butterfly, and go across, then you can do this entire combo. That's literally all that's going on there. So just for grins, let's do this just with the poi and the minimal amount of footwork that it takes to really go to the very end of this combo. What that'll look like is you're gonna go ahead and do one, two, three beats of a normal butterfly, do big arms around, stall out with them. Do one, two beats of a reverse butterfly, and then cross, go back out, and turn around in place. And as you're turning around in place there, it's either you can take that as just the poi hanging below your arms, or you can take that as a horizontal flower. Makes no difference to me. But uh, that is basically the entire combo there from a poi perspective. So let's talk about the feet now. Now, as we are just doing our normal butterflies, our feet are together, but when we go into that big arm butterfly, you're going to step your left foot across your right, and as the poi stall out to the sides, you're going to tap your right foot out to the right. As they come back here, you're going to have a reverse butterfly going on, and when they go across each other, you're going to kind of bring yourself out as though you're kind of like off balance and everything. Again, you're sticking your right foot out. As the poi go back around, you reach your left foot behind your right foot, and going into that horizontal plane, you unwrap, rewrap, and then step your right foot out as the poi come together over to your left hand side. All right, so all those pieces together will look something like this. You kind of hang out in place and do one, two, three butterflies, big arms as you step out, come back to the middle and swing around. They go out as I step back with my left foot, come around and right foot and right hand arrive at the same time. At full speed, it's gonna look like this. I do one, two, three butterflies, Boom, with the big arms, out, I come back, and off to the side, I reach back, around, and stop. Cool, let's see that again in slow motion.
pretty cool, right? There's not a whole lot going on there trick-wise, but I still think that it looks really beautiful. And I really, really love combos that make good use of simple poi tricks and make them look really good. So I want to see your version of this combo. Please post a video of yourself doing it to Instagram and use the hashtag DrexFactorPoi so I can come check it out. Uh, alternatively, you could also post that video to your stories and tag me. I am at DrexFactor. Uh, in that case, I will go ahead and make a copy of your video for my own stories and that way all of my followers can see your hard work. Please make sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe to help other people find this video so they can learn from it too, as well as help my channel grow. Yay! And finally, a huge thank you because this video would not be possible without the kind contributions of these amazing folks right here. These are my Flow patrons over on Patreon, and they, along with the wonderful folks listed down in the description, help to make this video and all the videos on this channel possible. If you would like to sign up to support this work that I'm doing, bringing flow arts and poise spinning to the wider world and helping people learn to be creative through their bodies and brains, you can do so by heading over to patreon.com slash drexfactorpoi and signing up. There you can get early access to all of my content, a say in what topics I tackle in the future, and some great extras and behind the scenes content on occasion too. So you should go and check that out. Please and thank you. Yay, I did it. In the time that I have been recording these videos, the sun has begun to set and it has gone from like mildly cold to very unpleasantly so. So I am glad that I am wrapping up when I am. Thank you all so much for watching. Make sure you get out this weekend and get some flow on. And uh, I hope that y'all are able to stay warm and happy and flowy out there. Thanks so much. And I will see you early next week. Peace.